Ruffles, Joyce said, trying to wake her up. Ruffles, it's snowing. She ran to, to the window and gasped. Pretty snowflakes were everywhere. Wow, Ruffles said. What a surprise, Chris said. Joy clapped her hands. How wonderful, Joy said. I bet millions of kids out there are playing and having fun in the snow. Yep, Chris said, nodding. Ruffles wagged her tail. Let's go outside now, Chris said. Ruffles nodded. Yeah, Ruffles said. I can't wait to get all frosty. Everyone laughed. They got ready to go. They put their coats and gloves on. Phoebe was making cookies in the kitchen. Ruffles sniffed the air. Cookies, Ruffles said. She pointed, she panted and ran towards the kitchen. Ruffles, Chris and Joy exclaimed. Chocolate chip, Ruffles said. My favorite. No, Ruffles, Chris said, scolding her and chewing her away later. Hey, Ruffles said, trying to push him away. Phoebe turned to the sound of Ruffles' voice. Huh, Phoebe said, that sounded like Ruffles. She put the cookies in the oven and then went to the living room. Christopher, she called. Chocolate chip. Then she heard the door slam from the kitchen. Then she sighed and went back to the cookies. Meanwhile, Ruffles was tossing a snowball at Chris. Missed me, Chris shouted. He was in the, his fort. Joy was on the other side with Ruffles. Here it comes, Chris, Joy shouted. Tossing a snowball. Ruffles tossed a snowball. It's cold, Ruffles said, shivering. Joy laughed. Chris threw a sno another snowball. Soon it became a snowball fight. Look out, Ruffles, Joy exclaimed. Eep, Ruffles exclaimed. She ducked. Ruffles giggled. Joy did too. Everyone had fun playing the snowball fight game. One time during the game, Chris accidentally hit a tree. Smack. When the game was over, Chris, Joy, and Ruffles headed inside. They got to eat cookies. This is a nice family tradition, Chris said, with his mouth stuffed. Joy laughed. Oh, Chris, Joy said. Later, Ruffles got up from the table. She went outside and sat on the front steps. She sighed. I wish my sisters could stay with us, Ruffles said. Suddenly, a bright light showed around the peeper's house. Uh-oh, Ruffles exclaimed. She opened the front door and ran inside. Chris, Ruffles said. She felt a little scared. Oh no, Ruffles exclaimed. What have I done? There were Ruffles sisters in the sink and all over the place. Second Ruffles came over to Ruffles. The TV sent us back to your time, she said. Ruffles covered her mouth. I wish for you to come, Ruffles said. Second Ruffles nodded. Maybe I shouldn't have, Ruffles began. I mean, why did I? Second Ruffles comforted her sister. Because you were being thoughtful, Joyce said. Coming over to Ruffles. Want a cracker? Want a cracker? 
Jazz! Second Ruffle shouted, smacking her forehead. Oops, Jazz said, sorry. When it was bedtime, Ruffles snuck her sisters upstairs to bed so Chris wouldn't notice. It worked, sort of. I wonder what all the noise is up there, Fred, Chris's dad wondered. Ruffles gasped when she saw Chris's father coming. Everyone run, Ruffles exclaimed. Everyone ran up the stairs, including Ruffles. What is going on up there? Fred asked, coming up the stairs. Ruffles slammed the door. Fred came to the door and knocked on it. Chris? Fred said, you in there, Ruffles? Ruffles put her paws on the door. Ruffles, one of her sisters asked, what are you doing? Ruffles didn't answer. Chris, Fred asked from the other side of the door. Uh, Ruffles said, then she got an idea. She got on all fours and acted like a dog. Bark, bark, she said. We need to get to bed quiet. Well, Fred said, <clears throat> I'm glad to see you two are just fine. Then he added, shaking his head and dismay, two-footed dog in this nonsense. Then he headed downstairs. Back in the bedroom, Ruffles was still trying to get her sisters to listen to her. Everyone, Ruffles said, we need to go to bed quietly. Ruffles was asleep. Everyone did as Ruffles said. They got to sleep on Chris's bed. Some got to sleep on the floor. Ruffles got to sleep right next to Chris. Soon it was quiet. Everyone had fallen asleep. Ruffles got under the covers and yawned. Then closed her eyes and fell asleep. <laughs>